There we are. What's up? What's up? What is up, guys? We have finally made it back to the United States. Not only that, man, we finally made it back to the Everything Regular Garage, man. And we've got some news to update you on, but I want to get a bunch of you guys in here so I don't got to repeat it like 50 times. But in the meantime, man, if y'all just now tuning in, man, how is everybody out there doing today? I know we've been missing in action. I know we've been missing in action, man. And there's a, and there's a whole reason behind it, man. So I hope you guys are having a, a hell of a day. It's like Wednesday. Senior Cable Guy, what's up, man? How you doing? The real New York. Great morning. Glad you made it back safely, my guy. I appreciate you and all your support. What's up to everybody else out there? Who else is in the house? Jose, what is up, man? We just got back uh, like yesterday or the day before yesterday, rather. Wednesday, Tony. It's actually, it's been going on for about a week now. I'm actually trying to get my freaking bike situated, man. I, I had to fix it the other day. The starter went bad. I freaking took it for a ride and um, I turned it off and tried to turn it back on and that was like all she wrote, man. So I sent it to the shop. It ended up being a starter. I got the starter replaced and then the freaking battery was there. So I actually just got back from getting another new battery, man. So this time it should be good. We actually may have a transporter. It was supposed to be here yesterday to pick this thing up. But like I said, man, I'm trying to uh, get a whole bunch of other things done and I didn't message him back fast enough. So they kind of looked me over and then went on about their day. So the bike would have already been on its way to Daytona right now, but we have to make sure it's 100%, man. I'm not about to send the bike out there and it's not doing what I needed to do. So today should be the day that we get this thing 100%. Um, I guess when I had did it the first time, like the starter or whatever was bad, I don't know. But we got it all situated and everything. Let's see what else and who else we got up in the house today. Ooh, dang, we got a bunch of y'all up in here. Let's see. It's the movie. Corey, what up? Body Rock, what up? J-Dub, Deontay, David, Carlos, Jason, Trey, Adon, Apache, uh, uh, Russian Letters. What's up, man? Irvin, Jack, someone's trying to run a scam, my brother. Yeah, you guys got to understand it's not me. You guys will know when I go live and freaking what to do. So don't fall into that. Don't be so gullible. That's what I can say about that. If you guys watch my channel, you guys know who you're talking to. If you're talking to the real everything regular, because if you guys won, I will call you directly and I will call you on live, man. So if you don't see a live video that says picking the winners and with your name on it, you obviously didn't win, man. So don't be the guy to send three to four hundred dollars to somebody saying, hey, man, I need three hundred dollars to send you something you won, because if you won with me, you're going to be winning and it's going to be coming directly to you at no cost, man. So don't be the one to get scammed. Don't be gullible. I'm telling you, it's almost that time to shine, guys. So if you guys are that anxious, that's just your fault. You guys fell into the trap of somebody trying to scam you when you guys already know the real everything regular and and how we go about these things. If you guys don't know how we go about our giveaways, go back and look at the other videos. That's all you got to do. That's all you got to do is go back and look at the older videos and you'll see exactly how we do these things. And you would already understand that it's scammers in the comments. I can delete them as much as I want to, but they're going to make a new, new YouTube page, new Instagram page every day. It's nothing I can do about people making other accounts. All I can tell you is that you guys know that when we do pick a winner, we'll be going live and we'll be choosing the winner on live and we'll be calling you up directly because I already got your number and everything, man. You guys won't pay no shipping, no nothing like that, man. So you guys know what time it is. He said, where's the video? What video are you talking about? Let's see. <clears throat> Let's see who else is in the house. Let's see who else is in the house. Still trying to get with you about being your cameraman. Who else is in the house? Dang, y'all been going up. Terrell C. Mac. Let me see. I'm trying to get everybody that I left off with. Kenneth Cameron Isaac, New Jersey, is in the house. Good morning, Piff Kush. Good morning, my brother. Everything is a movie. You write about that. Slack Hammer, what's up? Katie Texas is in the house. Keith Pepe, we out there in Cali. Man, send my bike to Jersey, man. We like on the last week right now, honestly. All the wallets and stuff is sold out. You guys know we substituted a bunch of wallets out for some hats. So all the wallets are sold out. It's only hats left. So I think we got only a couple days left, to be honest with you. To be quite honest with you, 
it looked like we may be going live give or take next friday um i want to say this friday but we don't have our other road glide back and i, I want it and i want it to be as soon as you guys win i want you guys to be able to come pick up your winnings but they said i see you had hella fun in the dr yeah, it was really a movie man if you guys never been to the dominican republic man i recommend you guys go and get a taste of that man because i ain't gonna hold you it definitely gave me a whole new outlook on just appreciating the things that we have because it's a lot of people over there that's working for like little to nothing and they're happy as ever man and we find ourselves in america running 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 chasing 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 just trying to be you know who we really want to be and it's just like we never really are happy if we're like completely just in the grind just chasing just chasing we never get the chance to look up and just appreciate the things that we already have man so if you guys um haven't been out the country or nothing like that man i would encourage you guys to try something new man the ticket was only like 700 bucks round trip so you got to think you're going out the country for 700 dollars and you're going to get a whole new experience that you never even got before nothing like that you're going to meet some people you've never even seen before you're going to see a whole new way of life man just just think of it that way you guys are going to go get a whole new experience i want to encourage you guys to try something different man fly out the country go get your passport man go try something different let's see <clears throat> let's see what else we got in here i'm trying to read y'all comments man i don't just want to talk i actually want to talk to y'all this morning so he said understood so yeah that's actually why we didn't um we haven't really been posting too many videos man you guys know i've been going hard on this youtube um with the bike stuff for like two three years just straight just kicking 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 so it's like I actually finally get a chance to like enjoy myself, man. And when I say enjoy myself, I mean just like take a, a trip that I probably would never even took and just really just put, not put my camera down, but really just focus on enjoying myself, man. So I know most of y'all like, man, we followed you for the bikes, man. We we ain't we ain't got no more bike content, man. You only do car stuff. You be with Corey, man. You, you're not humble anymore, man. You just, you're too flashy now. And it's just like, bro, trust me, my brother. I hear what you guys are saying, but I've been putting in the work for so long, man. And I, I ain't going to hold you, man. It's time for me to enjoy myself. Like, I'm going to enjoy myself, but it just it's just different when I hear you guys say like stuff like that, man. It's like it's kind of it make it hard for a person to really enjoy themselves if their supporters is like, hey, man, I need you to do this. I need you to do this. I need you to do this. When y'all got to understand, I have a real life, too. Of course, I'm on YouTube and stuff every day, but... As YouTubers, we have real lives and all that too, man. So you guys got to take that into consideration. Like, let me live a little bit. It'd be people in the comments like, man, you should be doing this. You should be doing that. You should be doing it this way. And that's cool. I understand that. But it's like, you got your life to live and I've got mine. I'm on YouTube with you guys, but I do have a personal life too, man, that I have to attend to. And just like, you feel me? Make sure I'm straight because I ain't going to hold you. I've been going hard for two years straight. I've never even took a trip on like just for me on my own just took a trip and just said you know let's just go enjoy ourselves i haven't done that yet so when i did it this first time like this past week i just see what type of like energy i got back it was just like man you're not supposed to be out here enjoying yourself that's the type of energy i got back and i just wanted to let you guys know man that i'm a real person at the end of the day i have a real life like you guys of course i'm on youtube and all that I love the bikes. I love building these things, but sometimes we just got to take a step back and really just enjoy ourselves because you never know, man. You could be gone tomorrow. If you spend all your time working, 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 and you never look up and get a chance to enjoy what you're working for, you can die tomorrow and it's going to be like, bro, what's, what was the point of working 30 years and you didn't even get a chance to enjoy it? So I want to encourage you guys to enjoy yourselves at all costs, man. Forget what they tell you. Do something you never done before, man. I just want you guys to, to know that, man. But let's see what you guys are talking about up in here, man. George is in the house. Welcome back. Richmond, California. When are you going to go back to DR? I actually want to go back in about two weeks, to be honest with you. But I'm about to kill it here with uh, this motorcycle content because we got some new inventory coming. And I actually already snatched it up and paid for it. So I'm going to show you guys that new bike here in a second. And uh, I'm just thinking about a new wave, man. I can't wait. New York need a delivery. We definitely needed a, a, a delivery in New York. Bro, I got my wife watching your videos now. She's low-key excited to, our, to win the truck. Savages, I appreciate you, man. 
senior cable guy i definitely appreciate you savages motorcycle club south dallas got love for you bam i definitely appreciate the love boost up the miami bike yeah so that bike is uh, actually coming together i already ordered the parts for the 143 so once i send that because i could send it out to la right now <clears throat> but i want it to be like I don't want it to just be sitting when it gets there. When it gets there, I want it to be like super, super ready to go in like a couple days or so. So you can come over by me in Florida when you get here. I'm trying to get to Daytona right now, man. Good morning. I, I love following you. You're awesome. Rebecca, it's, it's love. I definitely appreciate that support just because I ain't going to even hold you, man. I haven't really been feeling the love like that, man. I've been feeling like you guys are giving up on me, man, to be honest with you. I feel like, you know. Cause I really been seeing people like in the comments, like, man, he needs to humble himself. And I'm just like, bro, I just thought I was the coolest guy. Like what, how much more humble do you want me to be? What do you want me to be? Like, I'm telling you, I swear it's so crazy to me. Why you got the camera so close gang? My bad, man. I got to get a haircut, man. My bad, my bad gang. I respect cleaning everything up. It's love, man. Rubs hand like bourbon. I was worried about you wearing all the drip over there. See, that's the thing too. A lot of people uh, was worried and was like, man, you're going to get robbed, this, that, and the other. And it's like, bro, you got to go over there to really understand that. If you just watch YouTube all day and TV about places that focuses on the actual danger side of things, it's like... <laughs> you're watching the first 48 and you're and you're like man Miami's dangerous uh Texas is dangerous Atlanta is dangerous and it's like bro you're watching the first 48 of course you're going to think it's dangerous so you have to freaking look at other stuff you got to go experience it for yourself because 10 times out of 10 if you go to Atlanta or anything where the first 48 is filmed you're not going to end up on there man and you're not going to get that view so i would encourage you to go to the DR and really see for yourself that it's not what they be thinking it's like so <clears throat> I'm coming to pick up my Silverado and Harley. You know what time it is, man. We just got back. I actually think we're going to be going live next Friday, giving all this away. Because um, I'm actually just want to cut it and uh, just go on with my day and get you guys excited. Because I can't wait to see the new owners of this thing. He said, I'm going to travel to come see you. Oh, she said, I'm going to travel to come see you so I can pick up my bike. It's a movie. Rebecca, I got you covered. Makes you appreciate life when you go to another country. You ain't never lied, man. I'm, go I'm going to Bahamas in a couple weeks. Ooh, Bahamas going to be lit. Can't wait to get my hats. Yes, um, I appreciate the people who are patient, man. If you order anything after February 16th, it has not been shipped. I've been just doing a whole lot of other stuff. And uh, of course, we've been out the country. So now that we're back, I'm waiting for some uh, packaging to come in. And uh, hopefully that'll be shipped out before this week. But more than anything, man, you guys will have everything you ordered, man. So just have some faith in me, man. Have some faith. Have some patience telling you it's only me doing this stuff man so it's like i can only do oh so many things at a certain time and at the same time man so trust me i'm gonna get to everybody out there just don't give up on me let's see what we got <clears throat> i came back from that from dr balls was empty <laughs> i'm dying <laughs> bro thank you for the live because someone tried to scam me a few times yeah man if you guys are in the comments do not uh focus on anybody in the comments that say you won anything because it's not me if you guys want anything with me i will call you directly and we'll be on live when i call you so you guys know what's next for the channel i know you got something in the works yeah i'm going to address that in a second soon as i clear these comments and see what y'all talking about enjoy life because it's real short definitely enjoy life because it's real short you could be here today and gone tomorrow i'm gonna take some honey and eat fish <laughs> they look like they already own it <laughs> What happened in Mexico re really can happen anywhere. Yeah, it can happen in L.A. It can happen in Houston. It can happen anywhere. So when people say stuff is dangerous, I'm like, bro, the whole world is dangerous. Anything can happen at any given point anywhere in the world. So just be aware, be alert, be smart. Man, these YouTube streets will stress people out. <laughs> you ain't never lied. My guy, Built by Dre, is in the house, man. Shout out to my guy, Built by Dre. If y'all haven't, haven't already, go subscribe to his channel, man. He be going up, too. You have to enjoy some. Hey, bro, I haven't got my stickers yet. Nah, what's going on? I actually shipped out all the stickers and everything. If you order a sticker or something after February 16th, I just addressed that it's not shipped out. But if you order anything before February 16th, it's already been shipped out and it's out of my hands and it's in the United States Postal Service hands. So if you guys got an email, email me. I could probably ship you a tracking number if you place an order before the 16th. It's already shipped out and I can ship you a tracking number 
I mean, I can get you a tracking number if it was before the 16th. After the 16th, I actually pretty much went on vacation and haven't shipped out anything yet. So that stuff should be shipped out before the week is up. But let's see what else we got. Do what you want to do. It's your channel. I understand that it's my channel, but you guys also help me get where I am here today. So I just want to make sure everybody's got an understanding and everybody knows that everybody is like, us YouTubers is we're real people too, man. It may seem like this is easy and we have an easy way of living, but trust me, <laughs> what they say, more money, more problems. And it's not even that. It's just like so freaking much. And I have a problem with trusting people, man. So I do everything on my own. So it just takes a lot longer to do things, man. So we're going to see what's up. I'll give you guys a whole update on what we're doing in a second. I just want to see, catch up to these comments real quick. Bro, keep it 100. I appreciate it. Do you, bro, man. It's love. I appreciate everybody out there that support and being supported, man. Without either of you guys in here right now, I wouldn't be able to do what I'm doing, man. So if you guys haven't already, man, please like the video. I definitely appreciate it. We got 196 people in the house and only 70 likes on this video, man. Make it make sense for your boy, man. Post them day in the life. What'd he say? Post them day in the life vids. Be going crazy. Them day in the life vids be going crazy, too. Live life to the fullest. You only have one shot at it. That part, I want everybody to live life. That's why you should be here. That's why <laughs> That's why you should hire me as your cameraman. Your channel deserves for you to be in the front of the camera, my G. Where you at, man? Is you in Houston or what, Mr. Juneteenth? Because <laughs> that's my birthday, June 19th. Mr. Juneteenth, that's my birthday. Amen. Live, my brother. Yes, preach facts. A2 still trying to get with you about being your cameraman, my brother. I see you. Please don't comment it anymore. I will put you on time out. Matter of fact, let's go because I know you didn't comment it about 14 more times. But you still my guy, man. You still my guy. I just don't want to keep reading the same thing over and over. Now nah, get out of here and enjoy yourself in vacation. Trust me, life is so short. <laughs> that part, Mr. Real New York, you already know what time it is. But I'm ready to enjoy this, get back to the grind, and really get lost in the grind. Because I'm telling you, I've been lost in the grind for two years, man, literally. I only took two trips out of those two years. I went to Miami and I went to the DR and like people kind of lost their noodle. <laughs> They're like, man, you need to humble yourself, dude. So it's just like, man, let me get lost back in it. Enjoy yourself and your life. That's right. You tell them, bro, at the end of the day, y'all human, y'all deserve everything y'all worked for. Dre and you deserve it, bro. Y'all grind so hard. No cap. I'm glad you see it, Mr. DJ Williams. I definitely appreciate that, man, because none of this stuff is easy. It looked like we just pick up a camera film and do what we do, but it's more to it. Trust me, it's so much more behind the scenes that you guys don't even see or get it get can even fathom, to be honest with you. Continue to live, bro. It encourages it encourages and motivates me to do the same. It's up, Mr. Fred. It's up, man. Cheyenne is in the house. Hi, hi, Octane. What's up, my brother? I haven't seen you in a minute, man. Where you been at all day? Colleen, Texas is in the house. Just look at the news. What happened in Mexico recently? Just stay safe. We got love for you. It's up, man. That can happen anywhere. That can happen in LA. Man, I understand. We need you to enjoy yourself. And afterwards, we can enjoy ourselves winning the prizes. That part, Jackie, you know what time it is. Enjoy it, Young King, and enjoy your life. It's called success. Do everything regular. My God, that part right there. Come to Chicago. They want me to come to Chirac. Got to enjoy your personal time. That part, man, we got to enjoy ourselves, man, because if we don't enjoy ourselves, man, and we pass away tomorrow, we're going to be up in the air like, dang, man, I ain't even get to do this. I ain't go to the DR. I ain't even do nothing. Just mad. So don't be that guy. I got all my friends watching you. Paul, it's a movie. I definitely appreciate it, man. I see houses and all in the future. That part, man, we trying to get it together for y'all. I love this channel, and I hope some people win this time who actually ride that part. Much love from Detroit. God bless you. I appreciate that, man. James is love. What up, A2? What up, Javon? Roderick. What up, champ? Seeing your cable guy with the super chat. Do you, fam? Love what you do and your excitement. My brother, I definitely appreciate that, man. Get that up for clearing that. Get that up for clearing it up. Much respect. My guy is love. Man, don't worry about the haters. Do you, my brother, Jack? I see you. You good. Like you said, you need to enjoy life, too. Be yourself. Bro, you and Corey have great energy together. Yeah, that's my brother, man. It's love. Nah, bro, you keep going and living your life. Don't let the internet troll discourage you. That part. I swear, because that's why I really, I read the comments, but if I really read all the comments, man, I'll be here all day, like, mine just gone. I'll be like, bro, they really be thinking that? Like, I really be over here like, wow, they really think that. That's crazy. 
nah bro i got all my homies following you and buying stuff and all my peoples love your content it's love that bike is beautiful you are awesome you will always have someone someone being negative sending you love and like king my guy or my girl miss diana shellborn i appreciate that outside house lights is on you ain't never lied i gotta cut them off man they've been on for like three weeks the dr is cool i'll be there in two weeks oh it's a movie man let me know when you go i'm supposed to be going back in two weeks as well man so we might be able to hang out you never be scared of your own people that part i went and spent my money on never mind <laughs> those people who have never been outside their own state yep i'm with you my brother i've been missing in action for a well for a while but now i'm back javon what's up looks like y'all had a blast definitely had fun i will be out there next week on vacation i'm hoping to win and scoop up my truck and bike before leaving houston yes man we are planning to go live next friday I just got back, so I'm trying to catch up. This next week for me is going to be busy, so I'm be I'm gonna be trying to actually not be trying to be, but I'm gonna be posting videos every day, and uh, it's just we're just about to ramp it back up, man, and uh, just end it off with a bang. So I can't wait, y'all. Stay tuned. Memphis ten in the house, my guy Maurice. What's up, man? I got plenty of entries, man. Can't wait to meet you, big dog. It's a movie. I appreciate you and all your support, man. It's love. Bro, I'm finna win first place, and when I come take delivery, we can fly out back to the DR. I'll show you how to party. You gonna show me how to party? Oh, my goodness. I think I'm gonna show you how to party, game. Let's roll, bro. You good. Take your time. Memphis, Tennessee is in the house. Baytown, Texas, Chattanooga. I'm block. I'm gonna be blocking the scammers that part, man. Don't listen to nobody in the, in the comments talking about you won this, you won that. Text me this, text me that, because I ain't gonna hit you in the comments saying you won. That is not definitely not me. You need to take more vac vacations. Treat yourself from there. Hard work and dedication that you're doing. That part, man, I swear I want to take more vacations. But if I take vacations, everybody going to stop following me. And they're going to be like, man, you need to humble yourself, man. You need to get back to the motorcycle content. You need to build some more motorcycles and all the above, man. So I'm just trying to get them back on the grind right now. I want to flood everything and get it going and see what it is. So y'all see what's going on, man. It's love, gang. Need more content of the baddies next time. Hey, see, that's the thing, man. Out there in, uh, in DR, the girls don't really like being recorded. It's different. In, in, in the States, they love it. But out there, they don't really like being recorded, man. What area code will you be using when you call? Look for... No, nah, I'm not going to tell you that because if I tell you that, the scammer might try to get one of my, one of my area codes and be like, yeah, man, it's everything regular. So just know when we go live, man, I will be emailing y'all and uh, trying to get y'all to know when we go live man so you know what time it is let's see what we got i'm actually just about to scroll to the bottom because we got a million comments let's see what we got hi octane yo my dude been busy working we still regular my dude you're amazing my god people get disappointed for not winning me included but keep your head up move forward someday will be a day to shine much love that's the energy i love to see and that's the energy i love to have so mr hi octane man i definitely appreciate you man shy and i believe it's wisconsin or is it wyoming man let me know y'all shout out my guy mr high octane in the comments below my guy piff kush live life my guy was you able to ride those bikes i actually rode a atv through the streets when i was out there i just dropped the video so go check that out when we get off live i just dropped another dr video right now he said it doesn't matter to, to me if i win anything it's a movie Kiraco in the building gang it's a movie Kiraco is in the house knoxville pennsylvania vacation in places where the scene is lit in az we do a bike meet and race with food every sunday all crews invited it's a movie y'all are you going to do a special sale to finish this raffle i don't know man i don't know we'll see bust the harley scene in the dr that's what i'm thinking man that was, that was my plan when i went out there but like i said i never really get a chance to just have fun and just enjoy myself wyoming is in the house i never get a chance to just sit and enjoy myself so that's honestly what i was doing i got some content without while i was out there i actually missed a whole lot of content but furthermore man i did enjoy myself and i'm ready to get back to work i actually bought another harley davidson yesterday and uh it's already in la i'll show you guys that bike in a second and then we already got our rims for it and we got our rims for our blue road glide that matches our wide body hellcat that i'm going to show you guys in a second here as well man appreciate y'all man are you headed to daytona i'm trying to get out there man i actually just i was supposed to ship my bike out yesterday but it wasn't starting and i need my bike 100 percent, man i can't go out there my bike not starting so i had to switch out the starter my battery was dead i was trying to freaking jump it the jumper box i got is cool but it's kind of weak man so um i actually just went and got a brand new battery earlier today and then i just hopped on live so i actually got to put that battery in there and all that i just support my guy it doesn't matter if i win or not it's a blessing to support someone i like watching my guy charles i definitely appreciate you man it's love i wish i can do the same 
for you, my brother. We're going to try to bless you in the, in the best way possible, man. So y'all stay tuned. Y'all know what time it is. We are going live. Looks like next Friday. I don't know what date that is, but next Friday, it's looking like it will be the date. And that'll be, it'll be, that'll be looking like the date. We'll all be caught up, man. So we'll see what's up. Weak batteries will fry electrical components. You ain't never lied. That starter was whooped. Great news. Still going to see Paula in Daytona. Hopefully. When are you going to bring a prize to Miami? We're going to turn up Carolina freaks with you. Carolinas is in the house. Yeah, North Carolina, South Carolina, man. The Carolinas is in the house. I love going to the Carolinas, man. We didn't been there a few times. Look, we, he, just said, he just said North Carolina. He said, when you coming to Raleigh? <laughs> Big homie, keep one, be, keep blessing one giveaway at a time. My guy, that's all love, man. You guys know we, we can enjoy these things. Like, of course, it's cool to have all this stuff. But like I said, man, I'm only one person. I can only drive so many cars. I can only ride so many bikes, man. So that's where you guys come in, man. I want to see a smile on you guys' face. Like I said, energy, good energy is everything, man. So if I could bring a smile to your face just for, like, you supporting me, that's the least I can do, man. I'm telling you, great energy is something good to have, and that's something you want to keep around, man. But with that being said, man, let's catch up and see where we at with the whole shindig. Where's my other phone? We'll start with that because I did get another bike. If you guys haven't entered in for a chance to win, man, you guys know we got our 2020 Silverado Dooley truck up for grabs, paired together for first place with our 2021 CVO Road Glide, the one with the oohs and eyes on there, man. Head on over to everythingsregular.com right now and go get your entry actually we are all sold out of wallets you guys remember we substituted a bunch of wallets out so now we only got hats it's pretty much like two wallets per hat now or something like that that's what it came or equaled out to i don't really know but we only got a few of those left man so that's why i was saying next friday is looking like it's actually we're actually going to be going live because we should be sold out within the next like few days or so man that's what i'm thinking so second place you got our wide body hellcat i'm actually waiting on two vents that's the only things i'm waiting on on this car we got two vents for this hood that we need and that's going to complete that sucker off and have it looking just oh so just oh so perfect man i got a message with the number saying i won second place like dude was really running it yeah man don't <laughs> if you win anything from me I will call you directly and I will call you on live. So if you guys are in the comments and somebody responds with the everything regular logo saying text me, it's not me. I rarely respond to comments anymore and I like that. I will like your comments, but as for me sitting there trying to type each and every like comment back, I really don't comment like that, man. So that's how you guys will know. I don't really comment just to show you guys like if you guys are talking to anybody with the everything regular logo, it's more than likely a scammer. But with that being said, with that being said, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Third place, we got a road glide. Actually, I actually think I'm going to give you guys that one, man. I think I'm going to give you guys this road glide, to be honest with you. I think I'm going to give you guys this road glide right here. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. We're going to see what's good. But I actually got another Harley Davidson yesterday. So I'm actually about to show you guys what we grab but first no not first let's, let's just show you let me see what we got let me see what we got man so this is the bike i got another road glide it's got um like freaking upgraded like adjustable push rods on there it's got i'm pretty sure it's got some some little work done on it but you guys know my style man we're changing everything up everything's got to be either a 135 or faster and uh you guys can already guess what color i'm going with this you guys remember my favorite freaking harley if you guys don't know i will show you and give you guys an idea right now but those t-bars is coming off all that stuff is coming off I can't wait. The bike is actually already in California, so I'm sending it straight. It's actually getting picked up today. Ha <laughs> ha, Javon, you know what time it is, man. You know what time it is, man. But the bike is already in California, getting picked up as we speak and headed to the performance shop. So when we get out to California next week, <laughs> we can be ready to go. So now, so now that goes to show you these this new news I got for you man. So this is this is what I'm doing right now, guys. So I'm actually getting another shop 
in LA right now as we speak. Cause you guys know I moved out here to Houston. I moved out here like, you know, for a nice, a nice affordable place to live. And uh, that was pretty like fit for like, you know, you get more bang for your buck is what I'm trying to say, man. So I moved to Texas to get a better bang for my buck, but it kind of slowed down my whole building bike process, if you will, man. So, yes, can we still get in? Yes, man. All you guys got to do is head on over to everythingsregular.com right now and go get you an everything regular hat, and you'll be entered in for a chance to win. Meanwhile, what was I saying? Dang, threw me all the way off. He really threw me all the way off. Um, What the heck was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, you guys know, in L.A. and on the West Coast, when I was stayed in Vegas and all that, I was literally killing it, like like knocking bikes out, paint, wheels, performance, everything in a matter of a week, two weeks. When I came here to Houston, I was still building bikes and stuff, but now it takes me like literally huh, three, three times the, the time it would take me. So instead of like a week to two weeks, it'll take me about a month to like a month and a half to build the bike I need and want to build just because we be having to ship bikes from here to LA, ship them back, we be having to wait for parts from LA and ship them here. And it's just like, man, I'm tired of doing that. I'm tired of freaking holding myself back just because I got to wait to ship everything back. So I just feel like it'll be way more easier to have my motorcycle stuff set up in LA. So I'll have access to everything I need to complete these bikes off in a timely manner. That way it won't take so long to build. You guys can see the vision a whole lot faster. We can get these giveaways going and going faster. Like I'm saying, like, it's just going to be a whole lot easier and smoother. Of course, I love Houston. I'm still going to be out here, still going to have my house out here. But I will be in L.A. just about like every week, if not every other week, working on my bikes and just making sure they're 100 percent before we bring them on home. Just because, like I said, when they get here, it's only so much I can do in L.A., I know every plug out there. I have access to everything out there, man. It's just like, it's just way, way easier to get things done. A2, drop them hats for is at 35. I need all them new ones to add to my collection of every single one I got for more life. The wall of hats. My guy, High Octane, it's a movie, man. We uh, got multiple entries at 75, man. So you guys know what time it is. A2 in a building. That's right. Doing big things. AKA son from Ravina, Ohio is in the house. But yeah, we actually, um, that's the plan, man. So we're headed back to LA. We're about to set up shop out there. We'll have a shop out there. I won't really probably like get a house or nothing like that out there, but I will have a shop out there. And that way we can get a lot of this stuff done quick, fast and in a hurry, man. So stay tuned for that. We'll be in LA next week, getting our shop and all that stuff situated. So I can't wait for that. So you guys seen the new Harley Davidson that we grabbed. I can't wait. Like when I tell you I can't wait, I came back to DR, came back from DR and, and one of my supporters seen me in person. They like, man, you to be honest, man, like, you know, I really love watching your stuff, man. But you don't post no more. Like you don't post no bike bills like we followed you for the bikes, man. We followed you for the bikes, man. I love I love you building bikes, man. You do something that nobody else could do. And you like, you bless us with it, man. So the fact that you ain't been doing no more bike videos like how we used to, I'm just kind of like upset about it. And it really like, it really kind of like didn't rub me the wrong way. It just rubbed me. I was like, damn, I know he's not the only one that feels like that, man. So I got to show you guys that I still got it. And I got to show myself that I still got it, man. Because I ain't going to hold you. Sometimes you can get lost in this stuff and you just like, you know, you forget what you're capable of, man. So I'm about to show y'all what we can do in a matter of about a week or two weeks from something, well, from nothing to something, man. That's that's gonna be basically what we doing now, man. We gonna knock these bills out in about a week and just that, that's just what I'm trying to do, man. I can't wait. In Miami, those custom reels will, will take off and down south. You ain't lie, everything regular performance shop coming with, what about the land in Texas? I know the last bike flooded, yeah. I'm actually, uh, like I said, I'm just focused on building, like just, just getting stuff in and out right now. My land and all that stuff is still coming, but just, I want something like now, like I need this now. Like I need my bikes and all that in LA, everything now. So everything can be a hundred percent and I can just like, I'm telling you, I'm always on the go. So it's like when I get back and I'll be like, man, 
I want to go take this to the shop around the corner, go get the uh, 143 installed, but shoot, they ain't around the corner. They way in LA. So the bike been sitting right here ready for about a week, two weeks. We've been waiting for parts, but it's just like, it'll be a whole lot easier to just take this bike around the corner, drop it off and uh, go from there to the paint shop, pick up another paint set that's around the corner as well. Go from there back to the shop, put it back together. And then the next day drive out and go get the wheels, which is up the road too. So it just makes sense. Like you can, li I can literally finish a whole bike in about a day and a half, two days from, from, from bottom to the top, like literally had that thing looking totally different. So that's just where I'm at with things, man. Of course, I love living out here. I love trying to deal with these people, but I just know my access and what my drive and all that good stuff is like when I'm back on the West Coast, I know I can kill it real easy, quick, fast, in a hurry without a freaking effort, to be honest with you. So that's what I will do. So LA, we on our way back. I know y'all been missing me, man. I know they like, man, he don't even come to the city no more. He don't be mashing with us no more, man. Hey. I'm about to come back and flood. I'm about to come back and flood. So you guys know we got our 2020 um, road glide with this wide body charger right here, right? So you guys know I got the rims for that bike. Here are the rims for that bike. Let's see if you guys can see them. You guys see it's got the like the black with the brushed. So instead of ch chrome on the lips, it's pretty much black on the lips. And uh, we got a brush face like the rim, so it'll match up the car really, really nice. We got blue buttons on there. I wish we had some blue buttons on these rims so it'll, it'll match up a whole lot better. And uh, that would be dope. He said, personally, I think your build time is extremely quick like it is, but you know what's needed, bro. Yeah, I, I feel like it's quick, but I can I can have it a lot quicker. Like I can get straight to the point, get what I need done, and I won't have to take days to finish like simple, small stuff, you know? But these are the rims for our 2020 Road Glide, man. They look really good. You guys can only imagine what they're going to look like on the bike. But I want to give you guys a sneak peek at our new bike because you guys know we just grabbed another Road Glide yesterday. And I just want to show you what color we are doing on there. Oh, here goes the back wheel. You guys can see as well. Just get a better view of the rims y'all about to have on y'all 2020 Road Glide. Definitely appreciate that. So these are... Our other rims right here that was going to go on our new bike let me see see if i got a better picture of it you guys know uh reese's pieces was my favorite bike man so i had to do another orange daddy um, so our new bike that we just got yesterday is going to be orange i don't know the second color but it's definitely going to have some orange in it and all that man so y'all let me know what y'all think about it in the comments below man y'all see what's coming I can't wait. I'm ready to freaking kill it, y'all. Like, legit. Reese's 2.0 is going to be freaking sick. I can't wait. That thing is going to be nice. Going back, back to Cali. You already know what time it is, man. You guys know we from the land. I don't know what they call it. The city of drink, the city of angels, huh? I call it the land of opportunity, man. Because if you can make it in L.A., you can make it anywhere. <laughs> At least that's what they say for New York. And New York and L.A. is nearly about the same thing, man. But you guys know what time it is, man. We out here with all the oohs and ahs. I'm actually, those are nice. They're going to look good on the bike. Are you still doing the CVO rims on the giveaway? I surely am. They'll be giving away with the, uh, with the other. I've been waiting on the rear freaking wheel for that thing, man. I bought that stuff off of eBay in the freaking cinder. <clears throat> what's his name? What's his name? F-bomb baggers. If you guys know anything about F-bomb baggers, man, hit them up and tell them they owe me a freaking rear CVO where I ain't got it yet, man. So F-bomb baggers in Illinois, hit them up. Tell them everything regular need his rear CVO rent, and I need it pronto. If y'all need to know who to speak to, hit up Juice. Juice at F-bomb baggers. He's got my rear wheel for my CVO. I don't know if he sent it out yet or not, man. I'm still waiting. I've been waiting about a month, bro. I only got the front one, man. So make it make sense, man. Make it right. Get me right so I don't got to freaking be mad about it. But it's going to work out either way, man. I definitely appreciate y'all. Y'all know what time it is. I'm just getting this battery in here for the, like the third time. We going we gonna to try to get this thing in action, man. We gonna get this thing in action. Let me see. Let me see real quick. Let me see real quick.
that's in there. Let's let's get this thing fired up, man. Now, if it doesn't fire up, we know it's going to be a real issue, and uh, we're going to have a real problem, Johnny. But I've got faith, and you've got to have faith too, man. Alrighty. I hope everybody out there is having a good day, man. I'm almost done putting this battery in. One sec, gang. One sec. We about to hear this thing fire up. I haven't fired it up in a while. I actually need to fire it up. I need to take it to the gas station, get it filled up before we go to Daytona. And uh, once we get out there, we can address anybody who wants some racing action. Because I've been hearing there's somebody out there that's been wanting some smoke. So we're going to try to get down there before Daytona is over and give him all the smoke he wants, man. So you guys relay the message. I will be on my way in a minute. I will be on my way in a minute. Of course, Daytona is about to finish in the next couple days, man, but you gotta get something. So I'm gonna try my best to make it out that way and uh, get this bike 100%. So if we get it done and good to go right now, we should be good to go, man. We should be good to go. All right, man. So who is it on? Who is it on? You ever thought about putting beat on one of your bikes? No, nah, I don't like music and all. Bro. I mean, it's cool. I mean, the, the stock one does it for me. I mean, when I'm riding, you can barely hear it anyway. I don't, I don't even really be tripping. I don't even really be tripping. Javon, high octane, Charles. It's a movie. Let's see what we got here, man. There we go. There we go. They like, he's back, y'all. The neighbor is back in town, y'all. We've been good for about a week. He like, they back in town. So y'all see, we got that rumble in the jungle now. Got her started again finally. Now I really need a washer. Is this look at the dirt just sitting on here, man? The dirt just sitting on there. Y'all think we about to get off in Florida with the bike looking like this? I think not. I think not, my brother. I think not, man. I think not. We got some action, man. I gotta hit my transporter, see what's up, because Daytona is about 13 hours away. If I can't get a transporter within the next few hours, I might just load this thing up on the dually truck and head out there myself, man. So what y'all think? Should I load the bike up on the truck right now and head to Daytona? I mean, I'm gonna be putting more miles on your truck, but we'll be in Daytona sooner and uh, for sure. But I, I really don't feel like driving to be honest with you guys. I really don't feel like driving, but I know if we get on the road, get this thing going, it would look freaking dope as heck rolling down the road and uh, we'll get to Daytona and have a ball. That's what I'm thinking, man. That's what I'm honestly thinking. 13 or 14 hours away. Hmm. I don't know what I want to do, man. 
I don't know what I want to do. They saying, oh, well, load it. Load it up. Load it up. Load it, man. Would y'all want to come drive it for me? I'll load it up. Can one of y'all come drive it for me, man? Can one of y'all come drive this thing down to uh, Daytona for me? I'll load up the bike, man. Just come down and drive it Drive it for me, man. I'm going to meet you out there. <laughs> I need somebody to drive you down there, man. Eric, you ready? Where you at, Eric? Who else said yeah? Geechee, where you at, man? Aiden said, I can do that in one day. You better be. It's 13 hours, man. If you can't get 13 hours done in a day, man, I don't know what you're doing. Michael, come get it, man. Where you at? I am three hours away for you. Pull my ticket and I'll drive it. He said, you can borrow my truck, man. What you got over there for me to use, man? I need it today. Truck driver right here with a class CD. I just need somebody to drive to pick up. You don't even got to have a CD. You just got to have your license, man. Who can drive this thing? <laughs> they said, don't put more miles on my truck. <laughs> I got an NG and Chowder. I'm in Baton Rouge. Let's go make it a movie. It's a movie, man. Who can pull up and take the, the, the bike with the truck to Daytona Beach today, man? I need it there tonight. I need it there tonight or first thing in the morning. I ain't gonna hold you. That's what I really, 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 really wanna do. That's what I really wanna do. So if I do that, I gotta load the bike up. I gotta go fill it up with gas. I gotta go fill up both of my other gas cans with gas because I don't know what the E85 is gonna be like out there. Picking a supporter and turning their bike into an everything regular bike makeover. That might be different. It's gotta be an M8 and more like, and more than none, it's gotta be a road glide. So that would be pretty dope. Never thought about that. I'm in Houston with a CDL. I just need you in Houston ready to roll like in the next hour. That's what I need you. I need you ready to roll. I'm going to cover the gas and I'm going to break you off something. And uh, we're going to figure it out, man. I need you in Daytona. I need the truck with the bike in Daytona today. Like today, today, man. I might just ride with you. I might just ride with you. I actually think that might be a thing. I'm going to see how far it is and, and how, how, how much I feel like driving. Cause I'm telling you, I really don't feel like driving. I ain't drove fur, fur, <laughs> fur. <laughs> you see how country I didn't got yet? Got out here. I ain't drove fur <laughs> that fur in a long time. See, it's like if I drive 14 hours that way, I might as well go to LA. That's about 17, three more hours, man. So I don't know. Now that I think about it like that, do I really want to drive to LA? Not really. <laughs> Not really, man. Not really. I need to find somebody who feel like driving so I can just kick back and get some stuff actually done. Because if I'm sitting back for 13 hours, man, you guys know how much I can get done. I swear to you, I can get so much done if I just have to. But we'll see what's up, man. If you guys haven't already, man, please like, comment, and subscribe. I definitely appreciate it, man. If you guys haven't entered in for a chance to win the whole win I giveaway, you guys know we got our 2021 Silverado Dually truck paired together for first place with our matching 2021 CDO stuffed in the garage back there. Second place, we got our wide body Hellcat. I can actually show you now. You guys know every time I used to say that on live, I couldn't show you. So this is like one of the first times I can actually show you. Second place, we got our wide body Hellcat because I was actually showing you that one. But you guys are going to get this big blue daddy right here on them brush 24 inches with a matching road glide. So I can't wait, man. You guys know what time it is. Head on over to everythingsregular.com right now and go get you an everything regular hat because all the wallets and stuff is already sold out. So, that you know, the hats is literally on its way out as well man it looked like we are going to be going live next friday of course this friday is a little bit too soon because i still got a lot of other stuff little stuff to do man and i'm actually just trying to get to daytona today so i don't want to put that type of pressure on me right now man so y'all stay tuned man head on over to everythingsregular.com right now go get in while you can in the meantime i'm about to be thinking about loading this bike up and getting out of here because if i get out of here now i can touch down by later tonight and uh Tomorrow, we can knock some people off. Friday, we can knock some people off. And Saturday, we can knock some people off. And then Sunday, we can head back home. So that's what I'm thinking, man. Y'all stay tuned. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, man. If you guys haven't checked out the new Dominican Republic video, I just dropped a video about an hour ago. Make sure you click the link below and go watch that bad boy. Meanwhile, man, I'm in the garage trying to get this show on the road. I definitely appreciate y'all tuning in, man. It has been a movie. Until next time.